There is a lot that I want to cover, but I also just feel like I'm going to try to aim to keep this as small as possible. The first thing I'm going to knock out of the way is, uh, hello, happy new year. I have a personal discord server for anyone who is interested in joining. I don't want to promote it too much. So this will be like one of the few times I'm going to promote it in a YouTube video. We have occasional game nights and for anyone who's ever wanted to collaborate, I'm trying to do more collaborations with the community, but if you want to check them out, you got to join the discord server to so do that. Also follow me everywhere. Anyways, next thing, there's been a lot that's been going on, which has not allowed me to create YouTube videos as frequently as I would have liked. This goes back for a long time, so here's a small story time. For the last two and a half years, maybe not that far, but for the last two years, I've had to deal with a laptop that consistently and constantly crashes. That is not good for someone like myself who is constantly working on large projects, projects that require time, rendering videos. It's never a fun time. This actually all started back in the 28 Monster Cat Mix contest. Apple, I guess, gave me a defective device and every time I try to go get it repaired, they are unable to do so. I will post receipts up on the screen so you guys can see that I luckily have warranty, but my goodness, the amount of repairs that I've had to go through surpass the amount of money I paid for this laptop, and Apple does not seem to know how to repair their devices. The last two months especially have been absolutely torturous. With the 2019 Monster Cat mashup video, you guys probably actually saw that there was a few glitches in the export that I could not go back and fix because time was of the essence. I was actually considering myself very lucky that I even got the video out before the end of the year. Besides the point, I want to do daily content. Maybe not daily, I want to do more consistent content, a variety of content, but I always felt like I have been unable to do so because of the fact that I have a defective laptop. One that I cannot work on for more than a couple hours before wondering, hmm, is my laptop going to die on me? To somewhat put this into perspective, I've had to factory reset my laptop about once a month for the past eight months. I have never been able to keep long-term files on my laptop and I've always had to be worrisome of the fact that I might just lose everything again. I've lost a lot of projects, which hopefully does bring some insight as to, you know, why there are some projects that I've wanted to do, but I've never gotten the chance to do it or never got around to finishing. One of them being the where are they now for Monster Cat artists. I have a script written out, I have research done, but every time I tried to make the video, the video would corrupt, the projects would be lost, assets would be lost. It's not fun doing it. I said if I got enough likes, I would make a part two. And then I said it would probably take me a couple months and here we are half a year later, not done. That's just one part of it. Another part of it is a lot of the stuff that I've actually been working on as of late do not really pertain to my YouTube channel. I've been working a lot behind the scenes when it comes to working on college projects. I've also been putting time and effort into working on some collaborative projects with Call of the Wild for Monster Cat. A lot of it is behind the scenes, but I do try to work around with different pitches and different things that I've been trying to get towards Call of the Wild. Some that have already been going on and some that hopefully you guys will see soon. And then just general life stuff. You know, Christmas being a very fun time for hanging out with family and hanging out with friends IRL has been a lot more entertaining nowadays, especially since back maybe two years ago, I didn't really feel like I had a lot of people to hang around with and now I'm going out. That's obviously a lot more fun than sitting behind a computer working six hours on a script that maybe not many people would enjoy anyways. The last thing that I'm going to drop in is that YouTube actually demonetized my YouTube channel about five months ago and I was able to get it re-monetized two months later. Well, early in January, they demonetized my channel again. I do not really have much to say on that topic. I don't know why YouTube has to be so bipolar about the fact that they don't know whether to monetize my channel or not. I feel like my channel should be monetized. That besides the point though, I still want to continue uploading videos and I'm going to do my best to do it. Like I said at the beginning of this video, I strongly encourage people to join my Discord server. I've been super active there, so at least if I'm not active on YouTube that you guys can get updates over there and even hang out with me in VC or DMs or whatever. There is one more thing that I wanted to mention that completely slipped my mind. So ever since the beginning of 2020, YouTube has implemented the new regulations and rules that we have to follow regarding COPPA. For those of you who are living in a bubble, I'm just gonna go extremely surface level, which is basically that they have implemented these rules that require me to disclose whether or not my content is for children under the ages of 13. While in the past, I've always disclosed that I try to keep my channel to some degree of 
family friendliness, at no point did I ever market my channel for children. And because of how vague the whole COPPA situation is, there is no certainty to the safety of my channel being safe from the COPPA's new regulations. I have already undergone some minor changes that you guys may or may not notice to sort of dodge or try to push away any issues I might have with COPPA. I feel like I'm a small enough channel that I won't get noticed and I will not have any issues. The last thing that I want to do is rid my branding of the red panda that a lot of people have come to know me by. And while in the past I've always refrained from swearing in videos simply because I thought it was cringy and unnatural, at this point I'm too fucking tired to care and whatever, I'm gonna do what I want, it's my channel and I don't need COPPA on my ass anyways. So yeah, apologies in advance for that. In my defense, I've had songs on my channel with worse language, so it shouldn't really be a surprise at this point anymore. Where you might see the biggest change is I want to switch up how I record Panda Talks. I find Panda Talks to be one of the things I'm most passionate about, even though it's not something I've done as much of. But if I can change Panda Talks to be more towards the vision that I have for them, then you might not be seeing a waving red panda and a groovy background swirly animation anymore. Anyways, that's all for me. I have three or four videos that I actually had done, including a ranking for Uncaged Volume 8. I had a list video for the full list of Monster Cat artists ranked for the best of 2019. And then a couple other videos that I'm probably just going to scrap because it's taken me so long to upload them that at this point I don't feel like they're just things that I want to upload anymore. So apologies for that, but hopefully 2020 will bring in some change. And yeah, we'll see how this goes. We are so close to 10,000 subscribers, so if you guys want to help me pass that goal and drop some suggestions in the comment section below for what I should do for 10,000 subscribers, I would strongly suggest searching for what I've done for previous subscriber gold milestones because they aren't necessarily like big mashups or big videos but like i'll do stupid stuff like bake a giant cookie so yeah that's all i have for this today keep an eye out for more videos and again suggest what you guys want for me to upload whether it be more panda talks mashups from specific artists or whatever i'll see what i can do i'll do my best anyways that's all for me see you in the next video